I was attacked by a great white shark on the 16th of March in 2011. That launched out of the water about a metre with me in its mouth and then took me down underwater with it. Then it had its lower jaw around the right side of my face here and it had its upper jaw on the outside of my arm here. I actually couldn't see through the water for... There was just blood everywhere, like every, it was just red. As I started looking into sharks and finding out more about them, that's when I started finding out what a bad situation they're in. Probably the scariest thing is how many sharks are being killed for no reason. They're being culled by gill nets and drum lines for human convenience so we feel safer in the water. Sharks are an apex predator. Without them, the larger fish underneath them will go crazy and then they'll eat all of the smaller fish. And if we lose the populations of the smaller fish, we'll lose those oceans that we love. My motivation for continuing to try to push that message out there is to help with all of these studies, to help get the funding to the scientists. Coming together and partnering up with people like Osearch and Costa, it, it's so important because it gives us the platform to be able to get out there and get the research done. If I could tell the world one thing, when you go into the ocean snorkeling, it's another world. It's a connection to something bigger than you. It's sometimes the only place you can breathe.